you know what just for the sake of it i'm gonna show you guys how to actually do this shit so so we go from royal capital and um you basically want to go on the left here forget about all the enemies don't jump that side jump to this side now there are some penis enemies here that will try to attack you ignore them and jump to this well might want to put some life and you open this door over here keep going down there should be some enemies here nothing major but Okay, and now you get here, there's a bunch of rats here. That's about it, but you want to kill the fucking rats. An easy way to kill rats would be like this. Whoops. I meant like that, because that will like look at it for a second and then boom. And it only hit one of them. Great. Just wasted a bunch of FP. Oh well. Okay. Then you continue here. Open this door. Which will lead you down here. Now, once you actually go down there. This guy will get aggro. But don't worry about that. What you could also do is to just jump. And there's a bonfire here. There's a door and a bonfire. So you reset at underground roadside. Then there is a route on the right, but um, over here where you see the ladder, but we're not going there. We're gonna go straight up here. Just run past everything, it's unnecessary to fight them. And you drop here. Now, once you're down here, there's a route over there on the, you know, well, anyway, there's a route over there. Straight ahead of you. Well, let this guy come. Fucking rat! Fucking rats, man. I hate rats so much. Okay, and once you're done with the fucking rats. Then you go this way. And you see this little fat fuck over here. So if you continue going that way, there will be some items and the dung eater guy. But uh, we're gonna go this way. Some light. Ooh, a lot of snails. So, a good way to take care of that would be to use your brain. And then, chill down. Now, the mistake I did was that... I put this too close to myself, but um, we can fix that by doing it better now. There we go. That should take care of more of them. Yep. Still a lot of them left. easy work now the question is do you want to jump down here immediately or do you want to go get that item from there if you do want to get the item from there you should probably kill 
these guys first. And I just drank from the wrong flask. So I just wasted one flask on that. That's nice. I love these moments when everything goes to shit. Anyway. Check on the left. Yep. Got a little friends there. Uh oh. You know what? That was pretty good. Five with one hit. Well, this guy seems easy enough. All alone there. So. Glass shard. We go up here. Um, fuck. There we go. Now jump on this side to see what's over here. Okay. Can't see anything. There we go. Well, that's a lot of snails, so we can always do this. Ah, that went too far, too far. Yeah, let's try a little bit closer. Well, now it's too close. You just can't win, you know? Keep swinging up. Uh, this guy's up here, so I guess I'll try it like this. There we go. Alright. And now let's keep going this way. Probably gonna run out of light soon, so... Yeah. Ran out of light. Some useless item, depending on what you're doing in this game, but for me it is. Okay. Oh, there's a big ugly fucker over there. This is what I suggest we do. Not go there. He can't climb a fucking ladder? Oh fuck. How the... Oh, it's... Okay, it is dead. I was thinking how the fuck is it still alive? Alright. Well, um... Cool. No! For fuck's sake. Wow, that did nearly nothing. Out of my way, out of my way, big. Oh, what the fuck is this shit? How many of these guys are there? All right, buddy. Got something for you too. That literally had to be the last guy, right? There's no way there's more. Ooh, somber spinning stone, eh? Okay. Get your FP back and um, put some light. Let's go. I think I know where I am. Summer Smithing Stone 7. I think this opens the door that was locked. But you could only open it from this side. Which should lead you back to the spot. Or actually, no, I was wrong. Alright. 
Never mind that. But there's a lever here. Huh. I'm gonna go on a limp and say that this actually is the thing that leads back here. No, maybe I don't I don't know. I'm so confused right now. Where the fuck am I? No, there's one guy there. There's another guy there. I think I came back to the previous bonfire. So to check that, I'm gonna run to the set bonfire and get my ass slapped on the way there. And there's no bonfire. But you know what? The right place I think because Oh shit, I forgot they can use ladders. Oh, I am so dead right now. I am so dead. I am so fucking dead. Oh, fuck. Okay, um... Right. Shit. Don't tell me he can't... He can jump here? Oh, fuck you, man. Hey, <laughs> got you, dumbass. Alright. Now we go back here to reset our flasks. Oh, he actually jumped down and died. What an idiot. Whoops. Okay, that is the door. Wait, what the fuck? What? Wait, what? But... But how? Well, shit. Now we have to do all that crap again. Uh, so over here. Avenue balcony. You go to underground roadside, jump through a well, in avenue balcony, a little bit to the left, towards the church, you jump in a well, and you will end up here. So. Yep, that, that actually closed. Alright, so. Gonna run past these guys. Oh, you know what? I was wrong. I was wrong. It opened from the other side. Ah, shit. Which also means all these guys are back. Okay, okay, we don't have to start the whole thing from the beginning. That's good. That is actually really good. For a second, I thought that I fucked up, but I did not. Um, these guys are not doing anything at the moment, but that doesn't mean they can't do anything later. Okay, this seems like a good place to die, so... I will not go there to die. Let's try the other direction. Okay, from here, I think, yeah, we can go down over here. Smithing stone six, but that is that is good anyway. You should you should do that because um, if you do go back to the bonfire, you get all of your flasks back. So I do recommend doing that. I just got a little bit disoriented there with the like where the hell was I? Okay, got a string. There's a guy over there that's alive. Let's leave him be. Warming stone. Okay, this is like suspicious as fuck. Why aren't these guys doing anything? I don't trust them, so I'm just gonna kill them. Oh, there's a flower behind this guy, so. There you go. Dude, you wanna put your message maybe like here, not like there. But anyway. I hear something. Let's use starlight to see what's up. Ah, fucking flower. Okay. This is closed, so I guess this way. Oh, what the hell is that? Well, not too hard to kill. And we got something here. Ooh, look at this. What is this? 
Huh, okay. So there's something over there. But there's also something over here. Now that creates a issue that which way do we want to go? Shit. Um I don't I don't know. What is the what is the right answer here? Go past the flower. I think there's only one flower, so it might be holding an item behind it that could be useful. I don't I don't know. So let's go kill the flower and see what is the item. Oh fuck no. Nope. Nope. Nope nope. 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 These are the cursed motherfuckers. I do not want to fuck with them. Like, those guys are not a joke. They will insta kill you with the curse. Fuck, that didn't even hit anyone. Well, that hit one of them. Go, go towards the light. Go towards the light. Yes, you stupid fucks. Any of them left? Uh, I think not. Alright. Don't worry about getting poisoned. That's why you have these. There we go. You know what? That went um, pretty good. Yeah, these cursed lizards you want to be really afraid of. Since Dark Souls 1, basically. They will make you look silly. Whoa! No, no. Nobody. No, 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 no. Oh, get away, get away, get away, get away. Okay. Shit. Close call. Okay. Um, yeah, that right there, you don't want that meter to get full because you will insta die. Now, I'm guessing this right here is the right way. Oh, look at that, you got Nomad Ashes. That's nice. So that's where you get the nomad ashes. Now let's see where were we again? Like over here, but we we went from here, so but we're in the sewers. Let's check the nomad ashes actually. Are they good? I mean No. They're like the worst, literally. The worst that I have okay but if you want to collect all the ashes I guess that's where you get that one so apparently that was the wrong way to go I mean it depends what is the wrong way we got ashes so anyway I guess this is the way to go forward Ah, fuck my life. Oh great, it didn't even hit properly. Yeah, with these guys I'm not taking any risks because I do not want to get cursed. Oh fuck, there we go. There's like a lot of these guys. Um, I might need to start sniping. How the fuck are you still alive? There we go. Seem to be quite tanky also. Alright, so... This did one hit kill them, so... There we go. That's better. Better not be more of them there. Um, this guy. We 
bench, motherfucker. That's not open from this side, okay. Uh, can I kill that guy somehow? How about like this? No, it stops on the door, so... That's not gonna work. Okay. I see. Oh, fuck the shit is that? What the fuck? Okay. Oh, that's a big boy. What the fuck are you still alive? How? What is this guy made of? Okay, that has to be a different one of these guys. Omen Brain? Omen Baron? Barn? Barn? I don't know. Whatever. Bear, omen something. Oh, fuck this. Yeah, that guy was extra tanky. Golden centipede. I hear a bug nearby. And I'm kind of running out of flasks here, so... Yep, yep. Okay. What does this say? Therefore what? Oh, this opens another shortcut, I think. If it does, we do need to take it. Because we need all the shortcuts. Come on. Come on, you little bastard. There we go. Right in front of my face. Just need to make it there alive. Okay. We're back to the same place. but Okay, and we go do this entire shit again. This is the most fucked up mind raping section of this entire place I'm also curious uh, did I even try going here well now am I not an idiot was this an option this entire time but there's a ladder wait what there's a fucking ladder here you shitting me this is the shrimp place right so you're telling me at the shrimp place there was a ladder this entire time and I just missed it? What the fuck? Oh, by the way, um, since we're already here, we might as well take this guy out. The question is though, how in the fucking fuck do you climb that ladder right there? Like, I guess you have to drop it? I think you have to drop it. That creates a shortcut, probably. Which means... We have to... Oh, is that the guy? Is that... Is that the little fucker? I think that's him, because I couldn't see him anywhere else. Okay. This is try number three, and now, yep, yeah, nothing dropped in front of me, so that's where that guy is. Now let's just systematically take out all these guys, one by one, so we don't waste all our flasks. Now, he's too far away to hit with his daggers, but you are not too far away with your Loredas great bow, so keep that in mind. Okay, I'm gonna just take a risk and jump here and hope I can get... Oh, fuck you. Oh, there's another guy. Okay, 
Okay, well now we did it right. And if we remember, we killed the guy already here by sniping him. Which means that now we can open this ladder. Yep, kick ladder is it. So this now opens a shortcut. But also you might like to think about the fact that he can get up a ladder. So you don't want to fuck with that too much. Jump here. Jump here, I guess. There's two ways to go. I don't know which way is the right way. Trying to look around. In case there's a surprise. Oh, you can get the FP flask from there? That's nice. So in that case, let's kill this little fucker over here. Get my FP flask filled and um, kind of no idea what to do from here on. Well, let's see which way is the right way for starters. I don't need that bug really. Oh, there's an item here. Eye of Yolk. Something like that. And apparently there was only the health bug here. So, I don't need the health bug at the moment. Let's see. Let's see. Wait, I came from there, right? So I guess here. Check always behind the corners. You don't want some nasty surprise. Check behind the corner. And check behind the other corner. Just a moment. Okay. Whoa, there's a drop there. There's a drop there. You see, it's a really good thing that you have a life now, right? So we don't want to go to the drop. Yeah, I already see it on the right. Now this is a tight spot, which means you are at the risk of hitting the walls. So use sorcery. At your discretion. Watch out for the drops. Let's go. Oh, I hear something. I hear something. I don't see anything, but I hear something. Which is concerning if you hear something, but you don't see anything. Uh, behind this corner? Oh, that's a big mama rat. Right? I can't see anything. Fuck, it's so dark in here. No. Motherfucker. Well, I don't know what he was guarding now because I just dropped. Oh, you see, this is the problem is that this place is so fucking like tight that you're kind of fucked. And don't forget that you can hit the wall and it can like in interrupt your entire attack but the enemies don't have the same problem. So now I don't know what item I missed there with the big mama rat but um, let's hope I'm still going to the right direction. We can always go back there later. Uh, there's a pig 
big fat guy here who doesn't seem friendly. Not at all. Fucking fuck! Fuck off! I mean, I didn't know if he was friendly or not, so I didn't want to attack him. Head on. But now you know that, so... Attack him head on. And avoid my mistake. Alright, let's take this. Which goes apparently down. Yep. Okay, and um, there we go. We got another bonfire here. So we can now sit here. And this is called Forsaken Depths. Alright. And I'm guessing there's some fucking hard enemy there because... Holy shit, was it hard to get here. There's no way there. There's no way there are like enemies here, right? On your way. Spinning stone six. Huh. Why can't I summon anything? Fucking summon! There we go. Fuck. I got greedy. I got really greedy there. And I got greedy again. Fuck, it takes like 800 years to load this fucking spell. There. God damn it. Well, we got uh, Blood Flame Talons, I want to say. Okay, and what is this? Let's rest here. Cathedral of the Forsaken. Evertree's Favor 1. What the fuck is that? No way, is that one of those that raises all your attributes? H yeah, HP, stamina, and... I'm a little confused now, so... Yeah. Raises maximum HP, stamina, and equipment load. Sure. Could you kindly explain to me what the fuck is going on here? Okay, so... Ah, oh, yes, because I'm obviously... Yeah, yeah, okay, never mind. So my HP would actually drop by a little, but my stamina would come up by 10. And uh, my equip load by a little bit, but it would drop my... I don't know. Uh... Let's try this, I guess. Alright, and uh, this 